Hello everybody and welcome to Clear Path Guidance in Tarot. This is your pick a card oracle message for Saturday, October the 26th. Today I'm using the Heal Yourself reading cards. I want you to uh, think of a question that you need guidance on, a situation that you need answers to, and then pick a card that you are drawn to. Use your intuition, use your own inner gut, whatever it is that you use, take the time. I'm going to timestamp it and put a call in the comment section. I'm going to timestamp it so you can go straight to that card. It'll say card one, number two, number three, and then you cl can click on card number three and not have to listen to the whole thing. Okay, I'm going to count to 10. If you need more time than that, then just pause the video until you're ready to pick a card. Some people like to meditate on it. Okay, I'm going to count to 10 right now. Okay, so for those of you who pick card number one, the message is inner child. In order to be healthy, we can engage our imagination, creativity, and sponta spontaneity. When was the last time you did something spontaneous, intuitive, and outrageous? When and with whom do you feel uninhibited, relaxed, and completely comfortable to be yourself? Your inner child can be your strongest ally or your biggest foe. It can assist you to heal childhood pain, rejection, loneliness, and abandonment. It can take you on an exciting adventure, help you become more confident, daring, original, and bold. Or it can make you behave in childish ways, bring up anxiety, fear, and suspicion. This card beckons you to heal your childhood pain and discover your independence, compassion, creativity, talents, and joy. A healthy inner child can help you connect to your in integrity, divinity, and purity. It believes in miracles and creates magic in your life. For those who have picked card number two, it is healing. If, you're, if you are experiencing stress, feel overwhelmed, or suffering ailments in your body, or feel exhausted and depressed, it means that your body is trying to communicate with you. Your body wants you to start treating it in a more loving manner and listening to the messages it is sending you. You need to become conscious of the areas in your life that you are avoiding or suppressing. Healing takes time. It is a process. Your first step towards healing is to create a safe, loving, supportive environment where you can listen to your inner wisdom. And for those of you who pick card number three, your message is help from above. You are loved beyond your wildest dreams. Divine beings are working on your behalf to create the perfect circumstances for you to heal and open your heart. There is a higher order and timing to all things. You are being asked to work on your self-worth so that you can receive your greatest good in the form of incredible love, life-transforming opportunities, healing, abundance, and divine inspiration. Keep asking for higher help and intervention in any, era, er, in any area of your life. Then follow your intuition and lower your barriers. Let go of any notions of how divinity will bring about your deepest heart's yearning. It may not be in the package you would expect, but it will be life-altering. Altering. Your heart is about to be challenged to open wider than ever before. That may require you to feel some fear and pain. Do not run away from this experience. Take steps forward with faith that your greater good is coming. All right, everyone. Have a great Saturday. Bye-bye.